Hardball's Chris Matthews. And can I say one more point? I think sure. something that I mentioned earlier tonight, and I'm, I'm very proud I did it. And I hope I can say it the right way. You know, this country's been, and I grew up in a country that was driven apart by race right until the 60s. You couldn't have a black member of the United States cabinet. There were no black cabinet members in the Kennedy administration. Uh, it has been such a big part of our life in big cities, this sort of ethnic uh, d debate, ethnic fighting. And then to see a president of the United States who who is African-American, I was thinking tonight, this isn't even an issue tonight. How far we've come in just a year where it was a campaign issue in some parts of the country. It was talked about as something that would hurt him. And it wasn't in the room tonight. You could feel it wasn't there tonight. And that takes leadership on his part to get us beyond these divisions. Really national leadership. And I felt it wonderfully tonight. I saw it almost like an epiphany. And I hope it's true. I hope what I saw is true that we've gotten beyond it. At least, well... In the presidential level, I think it's still going to be out there in American life. But I think he's done something wonderful. I think he's taken us beyond black and white in our politics. Wonderfully so in just a year, I think. Chris Matthews of MSNBC is hardball, loving it. who is both fun to talk to and a big thinker on these things and willing to talk Thank about you. stuff that's hard to talk about sometimes on TV. It is. Chris, I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Thank you.